crown jewel of the U.S. Air Force is its elite demonstration squadron known as the Thunderbirds. For over 55 years, they have been thrilling audiences around the world with their precision aerobatics. On a crisp day in September, first-year Thunderbird pilot Chris Strickland takes his F-16 into the air in front of 80,000 spectators at Mountain Home Air Force Base in Idaho. His first stunt of the day will be a spectacular air combat maneuver known as the Split S. The slightest miscalculation can end in tragedy, and unbeknownst to Strickland, he's miscalculated. He's drastically underestimated the altitude needed to perform this challenging dogfight maneuver. He begins his descent about 1,000 feet too low. Halfway through the loop, Strickland realizes his mistake. He tries desperately to pull up the nose of the F-16, but it's beyond the plane's capabilities. Unable to pull out of the maneuver in time, Captain Strickland has no choice but to eject. A split second before the $20 million F-16 explodes into a ball of flames. The jet fighter careens down the runway for over 200 yards, and the engine over 100 more. A last look shows that Captain Strickland stays with the plane until the last possible second. Just eight-tenths of a second after he ejects from the cockpit, the plane hits the ground. Just knock it off. Thunderbirds, knock it off. You can see Captain Strickland's parachute deploy out of the cloud of black smoke. Unbelievably, no one on the ground is hurt, and Captain Strickland? Despite enduring an excess of 12 Gs during the ejection, he escapes with only minor injuries. 